Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you an easy math trick for multiplying by 11. It's a very, very easy thing that you can do to multiply numbers by 11 and get to the answer really easily. Let's get right to it. I'm going to give you some examples to show you how to do this math trick. So let's say that we have 62 times 11. Okay. 62 times 11. What you have to do is you have to look at the non-11 numbers, which are 6 and 2. And you have to simply add them together. So there's a plus sign. 6 plus 2 equals 8. So you take the non-11 numbers and you add them together. 6 plus 2 equals 8. Now you take your answer and you're going to insert it in the middle of those non-11 numbers, okay? So we have a 6 and a 2, we take the 8 and we insert it in the middle and that's our answer. So we have 6, 2, and all that we have to do is take this answer and put it in the middle. 682, that's the answer for 62 times 11. Literally, it is literally that easy. Now I'm going to give you another example because sometimes when you add the non-11 numbers together, you're going to get a number that is two digits long. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do that. So let's say that we have 76 times 11. Okay, 76 times 11. So we have to add these non-11 numbers together. We have to add 7 plus 6. 7 plus 6 is equal to 13. And if we do 7 plus 6 is equal to 13, you see that this answer has two digits. Not like this one. This one only has one. This one has two. So what we have to do is we have to take the second digit over here, the last digit, all the way to the right. And we're going to insert that in the middle of these numbers. So I'm going to put that in the middle. We're going to take the 3 and we're putting it right there in the middle of these imaginary numbers. Okay. Now, the right number of these non-11 numbers stays the same. And the left number gets added to this number right here. The left number on the non-11 numbers gets added to the left. The left digit of, these, of this number right here gets added to the left digit of this number. So the 7 gets added to the 1, which gives us 8. 836. So it's virtually the same thing, you know, when you have two, um, when you have two digits as part of this answer. However, all that you have to do is take this digit right here and you add it to this digit over here. Okay? It's literally that simple. And that's basically it. In this video, I have shown you an easy math trick that you can use when you are multiplying numbers by 11. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.